Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it's finally returned. I've brought it back from Twitch to YouTube. Plymouth Argyle. Hit the intro. Hello and welcome, and as I said before, we are back with Plymouth Argyle. We are in the championship. I did a couple on Twitch, um, and I've brought it back. Uh, we're not that far into the season. Uh, we played Leeds, beat Leeds, played Sheffield Wednesday, beat Sheffield... Uh, lo yeah, beat Sheffield Wednesday, sorry. Uh, we beat Stoke, we beat Swindon, we lost to Fulham, we beat Middlesbrough, we lost to Watford, we beat Aston Villa. Uh, we drew to Swansea, we... Beat Millmore, uh, Millmore, Millwall, Millmore, <laughs> and uh, we lost to Bristol City in the last game, and we are in the EFL Third Cup against Manchester City, and we will see that game and the Coventry game today. And if anyone hasn't noticed, yes, I have done the impossible, and I've made dreams come true, and I've brought Graham Carey back to the club. So. Happy days there. Gra Gra Graham Carey was probably our best player for years. Um, a lot of, you know, Argyle fans will agree with me there. So he's back. And now let's go and play Man City. Okay, and this is the lineup we're going to go with. We're going with uh, 5 2 1 2. Uh, it is very defensive because we are up against Manchester City. We've got Mikey Cooper in goal, Apuku, Nati, Mengi, Hutton, Perrington, who has been brought back as well, Ben Perrington, Graham Carey, McLeod, Ebby, Groot, and Hardy. Although, let's... Hmm. Go with Jeff Cott, actually. We're going to go with Jeffers. He hasn't played many. He's unhappy. I tried to send him out on loan, but he didn't fancy it. So let's go with that. It's a big game. Big competition. Big opponent. Hopefully, we can, uh, you know, snatch a result, maybe. Okay, and here we go. <clears throat> Six minutes in and no goals so far. That's a good sign. Ten minutes now, no goals. Still very defensive. Very happy to stay defensive for the whole game. Hutton now. Plays it back dangerously to Mengi. And Hutton's now on the right side here. Punts it down for Jeffcott who takes it well. He loses it to... I don't know who he is. And now... Oh, they've got Edward, look. Hutton intercepts, poops it away. It's going to be very, very much Man City this game. I can uh, tell you that as a bit of a spoiler. Although I haven't. I, th this is live. This is... Uh, Jeff Cott now through to Hardy. And Hardy's come through. And magically, we are now 1-0 up against Manchester City at home park. What a What a great start. Ebby intercepts it, gets it up to Jeffcott. He threads it through perfectly for Hardy to run onto him. And Hardy's having the, the form of his life. He's like Frank Nouble for us last year. Although he hasn't scored quite as many. But he's getting there. And we are beating Manchester City. Graham Carey with a corner. Into a puku. Hit the crossbar and just saved off a line there. I didn't expect um, us to have the better XG. Graham Carey again now, making things happen in the middle of the park there. Nati tries to look for the switch for Coop, uh, Perrington. Doesn't find him. Eduard. Ferrin. Or Torres. Ferrin Torres. Alvaro. Vincenco playing, looks like he's playing in the middle of the park. Jao Concello, Torres, back to Concello, away by Mengi, picked up by Gundogan into 
Oh, Mikey Cooper's just picked up an injury. He's only just come back. It was a bit of a risk to play him, but he is our better keeper. And so far, we've got three shots and three shots on target, which I am uh, really happy with that performance. Keep it going, outstretched arms. If we can uh, snatch a 1 0 win here, I'd be more than happy. Get a little cut one on the go, a little bit of money in the bank. Zinchenko with a corner for City, all the way through to Edward, who heads it over. A throw in for Man City now. Mengi heads away, only as far as Gundogan. Kerry intercepts that. Jeff Cott again finds Hardy. Hardy's got time to run, he's got past the man. It's 2 0. I don't know what's going on. I really don't know what's going on. It's 2 0 to Plymouth Argyle. Uh, and I'm shocked. I'm probably sh just as shocked as anyone else watching this. Who have they got in goal there? I don't know. We'll have a look at that, shall we? Uh, let's pause it there. Man City formation. Oh, they've got some guy called Stefan in goal, so I'm not sure who he is. Let's make some subs. Uh, uh, mm. Georgie Cooper can come on. Uh, we'll give Abby a rest. And I'm tempted to bring... I don't want to use them all, just... Do I want to use them all? Mm, do I want to use them all? Just in case. No, I'm not going to use them all in case Mikey Cooper gets properly injured. Although Tiden Mengi and Jerome Apuku are both one yellow card away from being suspended in the next game. We've got a comfortable two goal cushion now, so let's do that. And we will bring on. Lepsley. Lepsley. Lepsel. Uh, we should probably give him a bit of praise, actually. I've not said anything to him, and that is full time. And we have knocked out Manchester City after Pep Guardiola insultingly said, We are an easy team. So, yeah, have some of that. Do you have any words for Otter and for the following? I don't think the result was fully indicated of the bigger picture. We comfort we're comfortably the better team, but the odd result crops up now and then, and they won't be so fortunate next time. Well, we won't be playing you next time because that was only a uh, one leg. So, thanks. Okay, we're going to get right on into the next game now, which is Coventry City. Okay, we are back before the game. We have the next round draw. Leicester will play Manchester United. Bournemouth will play us. We get Bournemouth. That's that's all right. That is. And now we may as well draw all the teams. Uh, oh, big game there. Chelsea, Liverpool, Arsenal, Burnley, Tottenham, Nottingham. It's all Premier League teams, really. Burton, Albion, are still there. So we get Bournemouth in the next round. Now, on to the next game. Okay, um, we are back to our fluid counter-attack. 4-2-3-1. Uh, starting lineup is Mikey Cooper, Perrington, Apuku, Mengi, Hutton, Lepsley, Camera, George Cooper, Ebby, Graham Carey and Ryan Hardy. No room for young Jeff Cott, who played a hell of a part in that last game, so he's got to come in. He can play on the wing as well, so he is quite versatile. Right, let's get into this. Pump, no, carry on where you left off. Beating Man City. Should be a walk in the park. Oh, look, that stayed there now. Oh, they fixed it. They might have fixed that to stay because before it kept coming in and out. We'll check after this. Graham Carey with a corner into Tiedem. 
or Tedden Mengi for his first goal of the season and it's 1-0 and Home Park is rocking. They have fixed it. The Lushu will be happy. Let's uh, unprofessionally get a tweet out on this. Uh, tweet. Uh, delete. Sorry about this. <laughs> Very unprofessional. Not a lot going on in the game. Uh, just get this out to Kev. Oh, at Kev. Oh. And Coventry have scored, which is not good, but we're going to keep it like that anyway. Outstretch now, pump the fist. You've still got room for improvement. Hey, 2 1. 56 minutes into the half. Uh, gonna make the subs. We're gonna bring on Jeff Cott. We are going to take off Kerry. He's like there. I can maybe play him as a winger there, you know? Let's try that and bring on Groot, who prefers to play. The target man, but I don't like target men, and we'll do that. Confirm, okay. 66 minutes played, possession is all ours at the minute. It's 2 1. It's exciting times to be an Argyle fan. I mean, we it looks like we're potentially looking. At a title race, which is exciting. Three minutes of added time, and there goes the full time whistle. So that's a win. We'll check the table out now. Oh, I've skipped past it. We'll check it out now. And we are third, five points behind Brentford, who are top of the table. So I would very much consider us in a title race here. Now, let's have a look where we're going to leave it now. I think we will go all the way to the EFL fourth round. We'll play that in the next episode with the Reading game. And hopefully, with these games here, we'll have a little bit more of a title challenge on our hands. Thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed this video, hit the thumbs up, subscribe, hit the notification to get notified when these videos come out, which will hopefully be daily on this Plymouth Argyle save. It might not be every day, but it will be in an 11am slot. Thank you very much.